This is Mike Scott, the film critic at the Times Picayune in New Orleans. And if you go see just one movie this weekend, this is the one. There's a lot of good stuff out there this week, but I'm going to spotlight the Oscar nominated animated film Persepolis, based on the autobiographical graphic novels by Marjan Satrapi. Although it's animated, the PG 13 rated Persepolis isn't a kid's flick. Rather, it's a stylistic and quite grown up meditation on one girl's struggles to find herself at the outset of the Iranian Revolution. Directed by Vincent Parano, it's an interesting film on a number of levels. First, there's a gently buoyant story itself, which incorporates heart and humor to create an engrossing and rare peek behind the veil of Iran. Then there's Satrapi's mischief-making on-screen persona. Introduced at seven years old, she lived a Western-influenced life just long enough to see the rug pulled out from under her as Iran's religious leaders decided to purge the country of all things Western in the 1970s. And then there's that beautifully spartan but still plenty artistic animation style. Done mostly in black and white, the film is intended to stay true to the film's graphic novel origins. In so doing, it's achieved a wonderfully unique look. After a while, the themes of Persepolis do begin to feel repetitive, but it's still compelling, driven by the likable every woman, the likable every person that Satrapi's character represents. It's a film that's both heartfelt and thought-provoking, exotic and warm, and this week, it's the one.